Hello everyone. This is a demo video of how to set up the Asterix AI voice agent in your environment. I just set up a brand new FreePBX in my environment uh, using the FreePBX distro. So I will connect to the CLI of my server and I will clone the repo. I already have Git installed. Let me actually quickly check uh, Git. Okay, Git is not installed, so let me quickly install Git. And for the purpose of this demo, I am test just testing the staging branch. So I will just clone the staging branch. You don't need to do that for your environment. You can just clone the main branch. Let me go ahead and I will clone the staging branch. Okay, let me go into the project directory. Let me run the pre-flight script. So it has several errors, so I will see if I can directly apply fixes. Okay, so it is installing Docker, Docker Compose and other dependencies that are needed. Okay, it may take a little while. I'll probably crop this in the video. Okay, the setup is complete. Okay, the UI is coming up. Okay, my UI is ready. Let me access it. It is my IP and port 3003. Okay, it's up. The default username and password is admin, admin. Let me change that. Okay, from here on, it's very straightforward. I can go to setup wizard. Uh, let me quickly test Google Gemini Live. Okay, let me put in my API key. You can either generate it via the Google AI Studio or from the Google Console. It requires the Google Generative Language API. So let me test it. It says valid. Let me go to the next step. Now I need to enter my ARI username and password. For that, I'll go back to my free PBX. Settings, Asterix REST interface users. Let me create a new one, call it my AI agent. That password is fine. I'll keep it to plain text and change this read only permission to no. I'll create it and also ensure that static REST interface user is enabled under uh, here if it's not enabled enable it and then apply the config so let me apply this let me put in my asterisk and fit the asterisk host is fine the user is my agent and then there is the password you can leave the app name default let me test it okay it's connected uh, you can put in your AI name AI role or greeting and finish setup it will give you a dial plan that you can call in to make the test call. So I'll just copy this. Meanwhile, I can set up my free PBX server to receive the test call. Let's copy this. I need to go to custom uh, config edit. Extension underscore custom paste this context uh, for the purpose of this demo I will actually 
pass it the context and the provider as a variable. Like this. Okay, let's save that. And then I need to copy this. Go to admin, custom destinations, add a destination, and the target would be S comma one. Let's call it Google Live. Submit it. Apply the config. My AI engine is running now. Let's go. To, okay. So on my dashboard, I can see my AI engine is up. The default provider is Google Live right now. All of the providers are not ready. So these pipelines are active, but they are not actually configured. So let's make a test call. This number I can call. At the sound of the tones, the time will be exactly 3.11. So it's currently going to uh, speaking clock. Let me change that in the inbound routes. Let me route the call to my custom destination. This one. Let me apply that and meanwhile I can view the logs here. Okay, let me see when it's ready. Okay, let's make the test call. Hi Daral Hyder, I'm Ava with the Google Gemini Live voice demo. Ask me about the AI voice agent project. Tell me about the latency on this project. This Google Gemini Live configuration is the fastest of all options with response under one second. It offers true duplex communication, allowing for natural options and turn taking. Okay, that's all. Thank you. Goodbye. Before you go, would you like me to email you a transcript of our conversation? No, no, that's all. Thank you. Okay, so basically what I did was uh, under my config edit, oops, I asked it to use this particular context. So this context is basically configured here. And you can basically change this to your needs. So you can pass this variable caller name. It will automatically pick it from the asterisk if you have it configured. And this is how uh, Google Live demo works. And for all other demos, you can basically just go to your environment section and just add your API keys. Let me do that quickly. So you can either add your API keys here or you can rerun the setup wizard. So let's quickly do that. Let's do it for DeepGram voice agent. Okay, let me put in my API keys, test them. So DeepGram requires both uh, API key from DeepGram and uh, open API key for LLM. So let's go to next. My AR is already set up. Let's click finish setup. Let's apply changes. Okay. It's restarting AI engine. For testing DeepGram, I need this context. Uh, this uh, in my extension custom. So now it shows me my default provider is DeepGram. Okay. Now let me add the context for testing DeepGram. Uh, let's do uh, 
this one I will add it here I'll copy this then I go to admin let me save that then I go to admin let me create another custom destination to deepgram directly supply the config let's check up the logs hi Gerald Hader I'm Ava with the deepgram voice demo ask me thing about the asterisk AI voice agent project Tell me how to set up the project. To set up the project, follow these steps. One, clone the repository, git clone https colon slash Okay, that's all. Thank you. hkjarl slash ask dash a i dash voice dash agent dot get Before you go, would you like me to email you a transcript of our conversation? No, no, I don't need the transcript. Is there anything else I can help with? Nope, that's all. Thank you for calling. Okay, so basically it was using this context for DeepGram. It has these tools available. And I dropped in the call into, as I said, into this particular context. So I can do a similar thing for open API now. So let's do this. Instead of adding a new context, I'll just change the AI provider. Oops. This and I'll change the context to demo underscore open AI and I will apply the config okay once it's ready I'll just make the test call again see okay it's ready let me make the test call hi Gerald Hyder I'm Ava with the OpenAI real-time voice demo ask me anything about the asterisk AI voice agent project thank you goodbye before you go would you like me to email you a transcript of a nope that's all thank you Okay, and that's it. And for local hybrid and local full, I'll do a separate video.